NEO-281 lived 9,000 years ago and was found at Kosha's cave in Georgia. Genetic analysis revealed that he clusters with the Caucasus hunter-gatherers, a group of Mesolithic and Upper Paleolithic hunter-gatherers that inhabited the Caucasus region. With G25, this sample clusters with peoples of the Caucasus. I modeled this sample in QBM as a mixture of Zadzwana, ancient North Eurasian, and excess basal Eurasian. According to the model, NEO-281 is roughly 70% Zadzwana, 25% ancient North Eurasian, and 5% excess basal Eurasian. I also modeled this sample in QBDM as a mixture of 66% West Eurasian, 28% Basal Eurasian, and 5.6% East Eurasian. I ran this sample through my trait predictor tool for DNA analysis. Here is its predicted phenotype. It was predicted to have dark brown eyes, black hair, light brown skin, straight hair, and a Greek nose shape. He was predicted to be a warrior, which implies lower dopamine levels and better stress resilience. He was predicted to have lower D2 receptor availability, which suggests lower odds of schizophrenia and higher odds of ADHD. He was predicted to have lower odds of autism, to be lactose intolerant, to have higher empathy, lower risk of epithelial cancers, lower odds of autoimmune disease, intermediate odds of obesity, and likely blood typo. With Trait Predictor, he scored particularly high for the odds of rheumatoid arthritis, male pattern baldness, type 1 diabetes, Alzheimer's, and polycythemia vera. He scored particularly low for odds of testicular cancer, thyroid cancer, corneal astigmatism, AMD, exfoliation glaucoma, and eczema. He carried rare risk variants for GSS, Riefenstein's, Parkinson's, Putz-Jaeger's, FHC, Pfeiffer syndrome, FD, Fabry disease, phenylketonuria, familial Mediterranean fever, and blue-yellow colorblindness. I also ran his sample through my BetaCalc tool for health analysis. He scored high for odds of bipolar disorder type 1, type 1 diabetes, autism, skin cancer, lung cancer, heart attack, and hypertension. He scored low for the odds of a wide range of mental disorders and asthma. You can purchase his genome in 23andMe format from the link in the description of this video, along with my products and services.